In this video, we demonstrate the procedures necessary to install an insert into a honeycomb panel. The insert can be used as an attachment point on the honeycomb panel. There are two types of potted-in inserts, through and blind. For our first demonstration, we will install a through-hole insert. Marketing Masters manufactures two styles of through-hole inserts, the AEP-1033 through-threaded and the AEP-1034 through-hole types. First, we drill a hole into and through a honeycomb panel. Next, we prepare our epoxy adhesives, load it into a glue gun, and screw on its dispensing tip. There are many types of epoxy adhesives, mixing methods, and glue guns to choose from. In this first example, we manually mix two epoxy adhesives together in a cup. Then we place the active epoxy into a dispensing tube and use a pneumatic glue gun for potting in the inserts into the panels. This method is fast and typically used in larger jobs involving thousands of inserts. The other method uses a dual cartridge extruding gun, which automatically mixes the two adhesive epoxies in a baffle inside of the injection nozzle. In this example, we use a Semco extruding gun and Epibond's epoxy adhesive 420-A-B. Simply slide the end of the dual adhesive cartridge onto the gun, take off the end cap, and insert the mixing nozzle. Next, peel off the paper backing from the installation tab. Align with the potting vent holes on the insert. Apply pressure, attaching the tab to the insert. The installation tab allows you to inject the epoxy into one side, totally encapsulating the insert into the honeycomb panel. When the insert's flow control vanes are filled, the excess epoxy extrudes out of the other air vent. Now we take the insert with the installation tab attached and place it into the hole in the honeycomb panel. Since this is a through-hole installation, you should place masking tape on the back side of the panel, covering the insert, to ensure that excess epoxy does not extrude from the back of the panel. There are a number of different types of dispensing tips to choose from. The best tip for this application is long and narrow, to allow for the easy injection of epoxy into the insert's vent holes. Place the nozzle of the glue gun into one of the insert's vent holes. Inject the epoxy until it fills the cavity and extrudes out of the other vent. This provides confirmation that the adhesive is surrounding the insert and the insert is fully potted in. Last step, once the adhesive dries, remove the installation tab from the front and masking tape from the back. Your insert will be flush mounted on both sides, ready for a bolt to attach the honeycomb panel. Our next demonstration is the installation of a blind threaded insert. A blind insert provides threads which do not pass through the panel. Marketing Masters manufactures two styles of blind threaded inserts, the AEP-1035 blind floating nut and the AEP-1036 blind threaded types. Installation methods for the blind threaded inserts are similar to the through type inserts. Drill a hole into the honeycomb panel. Prepare your epoxy and glue gun. Peel the paper backing off the adhesive installation tab. Align the holes and attach to the insert. Next, place the insert into the hole in the honeycomb panel. Because this application is blind and does not pass through the panel, there is no need for masking tape on the backside. Place the nozzle of the glue gun into one of the insert's vent holes. Inject the epoxy until it fills the cavity and extrudes out of the other vent. This provides confirmation that the adhesive is surrounding the insert and the insert is fully potted in. Once the adhesive dries, remove the installation tab from the front of the panel. Notice how the insert drops below the surface of the panel if placed into the hole without using an installation tab. This is another function of the installation tab, as it keeps the insert flush with the top of the honeycomb panel. Here we have two examples of different types of potted-in inserts made from different materials. The first is an example of Marketing Master's injection molded composite insert. The second is an example of an old-style machine stainless steel insert. Commercial airline manufacturers, including Boeing, Airbus, and Mitsubishi, are enjoying the many benefits of Marketing Master's 21st century composite inserts, including weight savings, non-corrosive properties, high strength, and low cost. Visit our website at www.clipnuts.com for our complete catalog of composite potted in inserts, press fit inserts, and clip nuts, all with 2D and 3D CAD drawings or call us for assistance. We can custom manufacture an insert for your unique application.
Here is a video clip showing the actual installation of a honeycomb cargo floor panel with the inserts already installed. Notice the speed and ease of installation. Let Marketing Masters help you secure your next project. Call us today.